Hi guys and welcome to the sixth lesson of the Let's Learn Swift 2 course. So I just wrote here the usual for loop that you might have seen in other programming languages, but it will be deprecated. So the new for loop is for i in one and dot dot twenty three print i and one more dot. So it's writing out the all the numbers for one to twenty three. So we can also print current number i. So current number twenty three because when it validates to the end. But we have the num here, and what we want to do is increment it ten times. So what we would do is num plus equal num. and then print now. So let's see what happens. 2048. So first it's 2, then it becomes 4, 2 plus 2 is 4. 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 plus 8 is 16. 16 plus 16 is 32. 32 plus 32 64. Plus 64, 200, 128. 156, 512, 1024, and 2048. So it increments it 10 times. We can also do it much simpler. So just increment it by 1, let it run. it writes out 12, so it incremented it 10 times by 1. But what if we have two variables, so how many times? Times. So we can go from 1 to times. And it's going to be 14. And we can incremented by i. Now this is more complicated way, but how does it work? So first time the i is equal to 1. The next time it's 2, 3, 4, 5 and until to the 12 and that's when it finishes and goes forward by the code. So that is a for statement, a little bit different than you might have seen in other languages, but it's still cool. And in the next one we are going to learn the switch statement so stay tuned for it and I'll see you in the next one.